But, you know, adult illiteracy is a very real thing. And it's also very difficult to step forward and admit you have a problem and ask for help. But the volunteers at the Triangle South Literacy Works make it very easy. I was always the one that the teacher wouldn't call on to read. Or if I was called on, I had someone beside me that would tell me the word if I didn't know it. It's been 10 years since Heather Dean graduated high school, but because of a reading disability, she had always fallen behind in class. I sort of kind of try, tried to hide it in high school and then through college, but it got to the point where I couldn't hide it anymore. I knew that I, I needed to get it. Well, not fixed, but work on it. Heather recently decided to go back to school for a medical assistant degree and reached out to Triangle South Literacy Works for help. I was about a fifth grade reading level um, and when I completed I am now a 10th grade reading level. They're very brave because they've done some soul searching and they realize that there is some deficits there in their literacy skills um, and they want to hand up. And that's what we're doing. We're giving people a hand up, not a handout. Claudia Farr is the board president and a tutor for Triangle South Literacy Works. She gave us an example of how they might teach a certain concept when they meet with students once or twice a week. These are all called what? Quarters, or sometimes we say quarters, okay, word, or could be 25%. Okay, so they've learned quite a few concepts here. Right. In addition to reading, Triangle South also teaches math and computer skills to adults in Harnett, Johnston, and Sampson counties for free. And while the tutors are volunteers, the books they use are not. So the money we are raising this month will go a long way to improving lives. We can teach to what their current goals are. Uh, we, we can teach to things like a, a job or a better job or working with their um, kids at home. Becoming a better reader has brought Heather closer to her son, especially during homework time. We'll read it together. He'll read a couple sentences. I'll read a couple sentences. Would you have been able to do an interview like this a year ago? No, no, sir. No, sir, I would not be able to do this. Before this, I would be the girl in the back that would not raise. I would be looking down. No contact, no nothing. Now I'm in the conversation. I start the conversation. And our thanks to Heather for sharing her conversation and her story. If you think that's something you might need help with, check out Triangle South Literacy Works on our website, cbs17.com.